What Shidulka status to Methi the only reason for the violence in Manipur? Now various theories are coming up that led to the such violence in Manipur. The first thing which also comes in apart from the ST status is, is the illegal migrants in the forest area. If we look back into the data, we have uh, got access to the data which, stay, which says that in 1969, uh, near about more than 200 villages were there in Churachandrapur. But now in 2021, it is seen that 544 villages have come there. So it's an exorbitant rise of number of villages in Churachandrapur area. Not only that, in Kangpokpi also, there were 179 villages in 1969. But in the year 2021, it crossed 534. Now, this is also another reason for Manipur violence is a big question because last three, four months that the state government was, uh, was going against, uh, you know, the people who came as illegal migrants, they were specific identity check was started in various areas of the hills. So one section is saying that this is also one of the reason for which some of the people, they were not happy with the present situation. On the other hand, the people from the one section of the people from hills say that this was one, uh, this was one game through which the forest lands were taken from the people of hills. Now people who belong to the forest they, it's their land and it's a ploy of the government to take back their land but on the other hand the government side was that illegal immigrants were there and they have to be curbed down so this theory is also in place and we have access to a data which shows that there has been an exorbitant rise of villages so what led Manipur violence is not only the ST status but also a bigger story is there which deals with illegal immigrants, which deals with poppy cultivation, which deals with the forest rights.